What's going on everyone Reliance and welcome to the Star Wars Battlefront Cybernetic Female Skin video. The skin is actually finally here, I don't know if it's some sort of like glitch in the game where it's been released. Because it's actually free to use, I didn't know what was going on at first. But it's already unlocked for me here as you can see. It's free to use, it's there just for you to select. So I'm guessing it's some sort of Halloween type thing because it is Halloween today obviously. So maybe this skin has been released as some sort of Star Wars Battlefront Halloween surprise or something. I've got no idea. It looks pretty cool. I don't really understand why there's not a male cybernetic skin but I'm guessing they both look exactly the same anyway. So it doesn't really matter too much. It looks awesome. It's probably going to be a skin that I use quite a bit but it, I will get probably get bored because it's it does look just like a human so now I'm showing you it in game and exactly what it's actually like and sort of you know when you're running around the battlefield what it looks like really but uh, in all fairness I, I've had the worst game on this possible today so just excuse the gameplay I merely a teammate there but the skin in general, like I said, it's cool it was leaked ages ago we knew it was coming we just didn't know when so maybe with this sort of just releasing and it hasn't really been announced that it was releasing and it's free maybe in the future that's what ea star wars is going to do for star wars battlefront maybe they're going to give more free skins away maybe even more maps away for free i'm not sure what's really going to happen i'm not sure what this is a sign of it could be absolutely nothing and i could be looking far too much into it but I would like to sort of think that this is the start of some more free content for Star Wars Battlefront so that people who don't have the season pass can still, you know, sort of improve their game, get things for free like weapons, skins, maps, game modes, sort of things which would come in updates but like I said, this has randomly arrived. I do hope more skins come for free for Star Wars Battlefront because there is so much potential for skins. There's a lot which I think personally have been left out which I will cover eventually in another video. So it would be kind of cool to see them come because we only have one DLC left. That is the Rogue One Scarif DLC and we obviously know the skins in that DLC are going to be from Rogue One the movie and that sort of time period. Although that does fit in with the original trilogy, which the Star Wars Battlefront game is right now, I still don't think they will have exactly the same sort of outfits in the Rogue One movie as what they had in the original trilogy. So there will be a load of skins and potential outfits for the Imperials and for the Rebel Alliance sides for us to actually use. And hopefully, like I said, they will become free and available because we're greedy and we would just like a lot of free stuff, really. Well, I would, I would personally. Like I said, let me know down in the comment section below what you think about this skin and what you think it's about. Do you think this is a sign of more free content to come for Star Wars Battlefront? Or do you think it's just kind of like a one-off for Halloween? Smash a like on the video if you have enjoyed it. And if you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe to join the Aurora Alliance and be kept up to date with all things Star Wars. Other than that, may the Force be with you.